I began by asking, given the drastic cuts in this year's budget, just how much trouble is the Australian economy in? Well, the Australian economy is not in trouble. Uh, we've had 23 years of consecutive economic growth. We want another 23 years of economic growth. Uh, and as a result, the reforms you undertake today uh, will build the growth tomorrow. So we need to undertake these reforms. Uh, but there's no crisis at all in the Australian economy. So if there's no crisis, um, and a number of economists in your country have said that there isn't one, is this budget about ideological changes, trying to push through some things that might have been highly unpalatable unless you told people there was a real need to do this? Uh, well, no, I don't accept the premise of your question. But I'm just wondering, you're our second biggest trading partner. Should we be concerned about the status of that relationship, given you feel that there's a need for quite significant changes in your economy? Well, our economy is undergoing change. We've, we've had a massive mining boom, and the mining boom has uh, involved a huge amount of resources for construction of new mines and, and gas projects and so on. Uh, now, we are into the production phase, uh, so we are exporting our socks mm. off in in coal, in gas, in iron ore, uh, and that's one of the ways we've been able to deliver uh, low unemployment, high economic growth and a diversified economy uh, that has built unquestionable uh, advantages for everyday Australian families into our daily living. I want to just look at some of the changes that you have made and are sure. making. You've raised taxes. Your top tax rate is now 45 cents in the dollar. Ours is just 33 cents. How worried are you that some of your best and brightest might think that New Zealand is a better place for them now? Well, they may well do. And this is one of the challenges that we have uh, because, uh, because... Because uh, the fact is that if you make decisions now, you'll get the prosperity in the future. So we don't have to have anything to worry about in terms of our trading partnership with you? No, no, not at all. You accept them while you are rebalancing like that. There is prospect. You accept that some people could jump across to New Zealand because they see it of as a better option. Could, yeah, yeah. I Does mean, that we're... worry you? Your best uh, well, and your brightest? We've, we've just got to manage. Uh, uh, I'm rolling out in partnership with state governments around $125 billion of new additional infrastructure over the next six years. That is a massive, a massive stimulant to the Australian economy. Uh, and that will obviously uh, attract businesses to Australia. Uh, we're undertaking uh, significant reform in health and welfare, uh, education. Uh, that will uh, act as an incentive for people to come to Australia. So there's, there's twists and turns.